Guys, you want to hear a strong truth? Self-improvement compounds. The results compound. The more you do it, the better you feel. You know, I believed this when I started self-improvement because I knew how good I felt while I was in the beginning stages. But I didn't understand that self-improvement compounds until I actually felt it. And I feel like that would be, that would be the experience for most people. Until they actually experience the compounding effect of self-improvement, where you just get happier and happier and happier. You just enjoy life more. You feel more gratitude. Until you actually experience the compounding effect, you will understand this power. Because man, it's really strong. It's really good. For the past eight or so days right now, I've been on like heavy self-improvement again. Restarting my habits, which I took a break from because I became a bit lazy. But doing that and eight days in already, I guess I do have previous experience of the effects of self-improvement and how it compounds. But now I'm feeling it even more like now, you know, I'm bursting of energy. I've been doing workouts for the past few days. I've been so present with my friends. I've been so grateful. I it's just every day for the past eight days it's only been getting better. So to get to this stage, the most important thing you can do is just ask yourself, what can I do now that will delay gratification? That's all you have to do. Don't even think about the effects of delaying gratification, like the compounding effect. Don't even think about that. That will come. But you just have to start by doing something, keeping consistent with that, then adding on top of that, then adding on top and on top so that eventually you, you, know, you have a good amount of habits which you've made and then oh my gosh and then the self-improvement results really compound the, then it's like an unimaginable feeling guys anyway back to what i was saying i would recommend personally as a first step is to write something you're grateful for each morning that can be you know that can even be on like a notepad or something you don't have to get a journal right away just in the morning resist the temptation to touch your phone and check your social media and everything. Resist that for a second. Try to. I know it will be hard. Your brain will try and trick you to grabbing your phone straight away. But acknowledge that. Acknowledge that feeling. Resist it. Then just write something you're grateful for in the morning. Just write the date and just write, I am grateful for X or Y. Trust me. It seems very insignificant right now. It sounds like, like oh, why would I write something I'm grateful for? But if you do it for a good amount of time, and even just as a first step for your self-improvement, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it'll make a big difference. So yes, the effects of self-improvement really do compound and it makes a big, big difference. I'll report back in a few weeks time as I continue harnessing or using this energy that I have eight days into like full self-improvement. I'm only eight days in. Can you imagine like how I'll be or how you would be in like 90 days? 30 days? It's crazy. It truly compounds. Anyway. So I hope that you start your self-improvement soon. Check out my other videos if you want something to start off with. But yeah. I hope you do. Thank you.